G'day, welcome back to the channel and welcome to today's video. My name's Matt, but you all know me as WFX Malice. In today's video, I'm bringing you a quick tutorial showing you how to prevent your AirPods from constantly disconnecting from an iPhone. Now, there's a lot of overly pretentious videos out there on the internet telling you the very basics that you find in the first Google search result, which aren't helping anyone. And I don't wanna fall into that category, so I'm gonna explain exactly what the problem was we had, the steps that you do need to do, and the steps that aren't important that you don't need to do. So here's the problem. Brand new set of AirPods we just bought for Christmas for my daughter. She's trying to connect them to her iPhone 8, which she only bought a few months ago, and they were constantly disconnecting. You'd connect them, they'd disconnect. Connect them, disconnect. They wouldn't even play any music out of them. Now, this isn't the problem where one earphone isn't working, and this isn't the problem where it's disconnecting from an Apple Watch. This is literally just these being touched onto the phone, they pair, they connect, put them in your ears, disconnect, constantly reconnect. So, the suck eggs things. You need to make sure your phone's up to date. That's a no-brainer, I'm sure you've already done it. Second thing, you need to make sure there's some charge in both the charging case and the AirPods. Some people tell you they have to be at 100% and that is just stupid. Could you imagine that? Put them on in the morning, leave the house and meh, dead. No. Uh, the other thing people try to tell you is that it's a interference with other Wi-Fi and Bluetooth devices. That alone is a joke that makes me laugh. Could you imagine that? You get on the bus, you're on the way to work and these things won't work because guess what? Everyone else is also using Bluetooth and Wi-Fi devices. No, that's exactly what these things are designed for. You need to make sure that the case is within range of the AirPods and within range of the phone. Now, that's probably a no-brainer initially when you first pair these things because you have to touch the case on it with the AirPods and you're gonna have it right there. How these things connect is Bluetooth from the iPhone to the AirPods, Wi-Fi from the AirPod charger case to the actual earphones themselves. So this has to be with you. If you leave the house and leave this at home, you're not getting music. Now, here's how to solve the problem. Literally, connect these to another device. I connected them to my Android device because I was about to return them to the shop and get a refund. Tested them on my, on my Android, they worked perfectly. The next step is to get another Bluetooth device and connect it to your phone. So if this is a newish phone and you haven't connected it to another Bluetooth device, that's why you're getting this problem. So hopefully I've just saved you hours of scrolling through the internet trying to find a solution. If this has helped you, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below if this didn't work for you. If you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.